As a fire contractor, we need to understand the steps involved in any construction project. So today we shall discuss the general project cycle from estimation to installation. This class is especially for the beginners who are going to be involved in contracting field. Hello everyone, my name is Irfan Sheikh. Welcome to my YouTube channel Irfan CFPS. If you are interested to learn about firefighting and fire alarm system, please like, share and subscribe to my YouTube channel Irfan CFPS. So let's jump into our topic today. So we are going to uh, discuss about the firefighting project steps from estimation to construction. So the first step will be as a fire contractor, we need to approach main contractor and collect the required data such as firefighting design drawings, bill of quantities and technical specifications. So the second step will be is to review the firefighting design specifications, BOQ and need to start preparing the RFQs for all the materials required for the project. The third step is to get the quotations from various vendors or suppliers by sending the RFQs for all the materials or equipments that are going to be used in the particular project. In fourth step, need to start preparing the cost estimation separately for materials and also for the installation. So we are going to make two sheets. One is for the material which is called as material costing sheet and the other is for the labor which is called as installation sheet. So in fifth step, review thoroughly material and installation cost and send it to your head of the department or your immediate manager for his review. And then in sixth step, prepare the offer proposal for the firefighting system by keeping some profit margin and submit it to the main contractor or client. If there is uh, you know client involved in the project and also we are directly dealing with the client then we need to submit our proposal to the client in case if there is any main contractor or civil contractor to whom uh, we are dealing with then our offer proposal shall be submitted to the main contractor and then follow up with the main contractor on your particular proposal regularly till you get the project. This will be the seventh step. In eighth step, need to negotiate the overall price with the main contractor or client. And then once the discussion has been finalized, revised, revise your proposal and win the bid. As a ninth step, get the contract documents and go through each and every point or clause and finalize the contractual terms with the main contractor or client. And then start preparing material submittals, shop drawings and calculations in line with the project technical specifications. Upon preparation of material submittals, drawings and calculations, we need to submit the documents to the fire consultant for his approval. In 12th step, simultaneously when you are going to prepare the submittals and drawings, just send your site engineer to the project for his you know or to check the status of the project so upon approvals we can start the site and uh, installation can be proceeded ahead as per the shop drawings so last step will be the 14th step here finally upon execution of the works or installing all the equipments at site we need to do the final testing and commissioning as per NFPA requirements and this has to be done in presence of a fire consultant and also client and finally we need to hand over the project.